Hello and welcome to Quantitative Aptitude video from CareerRight.com. In this video, we would be dealing with problems on odd men out, which is quite a simple topic if you practice it. Now, the problems on this topic can easily be asked in various entrance examinations, especially easy B school entrance examinations like MAT, SBI exams, or other government exams. So what we actually require in such questions is a bit of practice so that you can go on and uh, find out the pattern by straight away looking, looking at a question. Now the first question, 1, 7, 15, 23, 36, 45 and 55 are given. We need to find out a number which stands out of the crowd. So 1, 7, 15, 23, 36, 45 and 55. Each and every number we can see here is an odd number other than 36. So 36 stands out of the queue. This would be an odd number. This was an easy one to play. Now second question. 23, 37, 41, 43, 47, 53, 61, 71, 73 and 81. Now there is no even number here. All the numbers are odd. So the first question's pattern cannot be applied here. The other thing which can be applied here, we can clearly see that 81 is the only number which is not the prime number. Every other number is a prime number. So 81 stands out of the queue. So 81 would, would be the odd number. Now third question. 726, 63, 123, 215 and 342. Now there are two uh, even numbers here and all the other numbers are odd so no previous pattern can be applied here one thing can be noticed that each number is one subtracted by a cube number so 8 minus 1 is 7 27 minus 1 is 26 64 minus 1 is 63 this stands out till now 216 minus 1 215, 343 minus 1 is 343. So we can clearly see 123 is the only exception. So 2 to the power 3 minus 1 forms 7, 3 to the power 3 minus 1 forms 26, 4 to the power 3 minus 1 forms 263, 6 to the power 3 minus 1 forms 215, and 7 to the power 3 minus 1 forms 342. 123 does not follow the pattern. So it would stand out of the ground. Now 253, 341, 485, 583, 682 and 792. Now this question, we can clearly see in this question that there are all the three digits number. So there is something to play from the digits in the in these numbers. So we can clearly see 3 plus 2 adds up to 5, 1 plus 3 adds up to 4, 5 plus 4 does not add up to 8. Let's see the other number. 3 plus 8 is equal to 5. 3 plus 5 is equal to 8. 2 plus 6 is equal to 8. And 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. So only 485 is a number which is not following the pattern. Each number except this number has the sum as the sum of first and last digit. The middle digit is the sum of first and last digit. So therefore 485 is the odd one. Now fifth question, 123, 224, 549, 819, 332 and 235. We can clearly see 1 plus 2 goes up to 3, 2 plus 2 goes up to 4, 5 plus 4 goes up to 9, 8 plus 1 goes up to 9, 9 3 plus 2 does not goes up to 2 and 2 plus 3 goes up to 5. So only 332 is a number where last digit is not the sum of first two. So 332 stands out the crowd. So such are the questions asked in this topic. You should be able to practice the questions in order to learn the pattern. I hope this video would prove to be of great help to you. Thank you.